So this is the 2018 Sosa 124 San Lorenzo. Which we're going to take a look at. So walking in the salon, you've got these two bar areas on either side, lacquered silver grey TV on a swivel, balcony to the starboard side, this big sofa, formal dining table forwards. Again, you've got the galley, I think, and crew access to the port. You've got an entryway on either the port and starboard side. Forward is going to be the day head, I'm assuming, on this side. On this side, I was wrong. This is a satin finished mat joinery. This is an entrance foyer area, which is interesting, with a big hanging locker and some pocket doors that close, bookshelf. centerline king size bed and then we've got a bathtub and a sink on this side with a head on the port side there are the panels around the television condition is very very good so we're going down into the guest cabins We're going to have two side-by-sides and a Pullman, the port side, and then the starboard side. Same configuration. Decent sized window. And then we've got two VIP guest cabins, starboard side, the bed's under the window. This is actually quite tasteful, this uh, lacquered gloss with the, uh, the wood combination. It's a mirrored cabin. Okay, let's go up to the Sky Lounge. So we're going up to the Sky Lounge and the helm area. This is nice open straight out with a service bar pantry that goes through into the pilot house that will go down to the galley and into the crew quarters nice array of instruments captain's cabin is here i don't know if it's open not but it's there and then you've got this window which shows all the way through to the back of the uh, aft sun deck we'll go forwards onto the bow now so there's two wind controls and then forwards you've got these two high low tables which are nice because they fold down into a sump pad. Rescue tenders on the bow. And storage on either side. That's removable carbon fiber crane. You could put a couple of awning poles here and shade this area if you wanted. Some of the glass, a couple of areas, starting to delaminate a little bit. Looking out of the pilot house is a stairway down on the starboard side. And on the port side, there isn't because it's giving you more salon space. We 
can see this is a void so you've got more internal volume up here which gives you this serving pantry going through into the main sky lounge which is accessed from here also there's this bar area sofa pop-up television quite spacious and comfortable you could put a card table or something here Through these sliding electric doors. There's a table here that seats 10, and then you've got this wraparound seating behind with a sunshade over the top of it. This is a nice area. And okay, now we'll go up to the sun deck. So, this is the stairway up to the sun deck spiral. some freestanding sun lounges, bar, bar stalls, and then a jacuzzi tub underneath a louvre shade on the top. This is a decent size. This is a very big jacuzzi with seating all around. Okay, so we've got a access up to the bridge, which is the galley. They're running with seven crew. That's access back out to the entry on the starboard side. And then this is the crew quarters. Three cabins, six crew and a crew mess down here. refrigerator and a freezer, wine cooler. So we've got an engine room access from the aft deck, not the side deck which is unusual. So this will be access to some technical spaces. Open this. Control room. Let's access into the garage. Aircon. Air conditioning. See the doors? Yeah, if you could, please. That's the garage, correct? Into the garage. Okay, that's the garage. So you've got 5.5 tender, 5.5 tender, and maybe room for a jet ski, possibly, or not. Uh, yeah, maybe. Maybe. Outside. And then you've got a technical room on the starboard side here, I believe. Ah, frequency okay. converters, there you go. Ready to go to the US. So we're going into the engine room. Everything looks really good shape. The boat must have very few hours on it. There's a tunnel down here that goes through into the crew area, I guess. Nicely laid out engine room. Generators. Very, very clean. So this is the San Lorenzo 124, 1500 hours, 3000 generators, 2018, very clean boat. 